Hey, what's going on everybody? This is D here with High Off Blue Hour and we are going to go over how to connect your Panasonic Lumix G7 camera to your mobile Android device using the Panasonic Image app. So uh, I'm going to emphasize Android because that's the type of device I have. So I'm going to be honest, I can't really confidently tell you how to do this with an iPhone just because I've never did it. So just want to be upfront about that. So, but the way we want to do this, we're going to start out. We want to go into the menu on the uh, Lumix G7. And then we want to go down to the wrench icon right here. We're going to click on that and we're going to go right here where it says Wi-Fi. Click on that. And then we got this screen where it says Wi-Fi function and Wi-Fi setup. We're going to click on Wi-Fi function and then we want to click on new connection. And we're going to click on remote shooting and view because that's, I mean, that's what I use all of this for and I'm going to guess that that's probably what the majority of other people that are going to try to connect their Panasonic their Lumix to their phone are probably going to use it for this purpose as well and this is all I've ever used this connection for is remote shooting and view so I'm not going to talk about transferring images or connecting it to a TV or anything like that at least not in this video so you want to click on remote shooting and view and when you do that, you're gonna get this. this is, it says select Wi-Fi settings from smartphone. Please connect to the following. And then it gives you the basically the address for the Lumix G7's Wi-Fi. So then with that in mind, now we're going to open up the image app on your mobile device. And now once your image app opens up, now you might get one of these kind of pop-up screens. You can just cancel out of that. You want to go down here to the bottom where you got these kind of menu items along the bottom of the um, screen. You want to click on this far right one here and click on that. And then you're going to get these other menu items that are going to pop up where it says set connection destination, playback settings, application function. You want to click on set connection destination. Then you're going to get this screen connection destination settings. And uh, you got select a camera, digital camera, that's what we want. Select a function, remote shooting and view, that's what we want. Select connection method, direct, that's what we want. If you don't already have these settings in your app, uh, put, you know, select them so this is what you have. And then where it says Wi-Fi here, click that Wi-Fi and then you're going to get a list of available networks all right and among that list there should be the address for the lumix g7's wi-fi you want to click on that and then you'll connect to it you might get a pop-up menu that talks about you know internet may not be available etc etc just ignore that and then go back to the main menu of the image app like this and you've got these four icons at the top where it says Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, QR code, NFC touch. Click Wi-Fi. I'm gonna click on that and then you're gonna get another list of Wi-Fi, available Wi-Fi destinations. And then you'll see the G7's address right there. Click that. And so now what's gonna happen is the G7 should connect to your phone and it's gonna say under remote control like that. And then if you look at your mobile device, you'll see you got kind of a, a camera symbol and below that camera symbol, you have the G7's Wi-Fi address. And so now we're connected. So what we're going to do now is we're going to click this button right here that says remote operation because that's what we want. And there it is. We are now fully synced up with the G7 camera. Now the camera, actually isn't I'm just sitting at a desk so we're kind of not really looking at anything I'll point the camera over here just a little bit so you can kind of see we're just kind of looking at some knickknacks that are sitting on my desk or whatever so but we're all linked up now and then if you look at the the mobile app on you know if you look at your mobile device you can see you click this drop down arrow and you've got all kinds of settings that you can now adjust to 
you know, for your liking, you know, manual focus, auto focus, white balance, ISO, uh, just all of those things. And then obviously you can also take photos if you want. So you've got the shutter button right there for your camera for snapping photos. And then you obviously you got the recording button right there for shooting video. So that's how you do it, you guys. This is how you connect your Lumix G7 to your mobile Android device uh, using the Panasonic Image app, which you know you can just download in the Google, the Google Play Store. And this is a possible thing to do with the iPhone as well. I just don't know the specific steps for doing it firsthand. So, um, so yeah, there it is, you guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, this can help you out, and uh, catch you on the next one.